these are the door panels for the Triumph TR4, TR4A, TR5 and TR250 models. They've been made in vinyl as per original specification. The hardboard panels themselves are cut on our CNC machine, so millimetre perfect each time. They have all of the necessary fixing holes around the outside. Uh, see our website for details on the best way of attaching these panels because they are a bit tricky. Uh, you also get pilot holes, and that is a crucial word there. They are pilot holes that are meant to represent the centre of the holes that you need to uh, drill out a bit further to fit the following parts. So up here you have a pair of small pilot holes. That is for the door pull that was originally featured on the TR4 models, uh, TR4As as well. Um, we leave them on the door panels because some people, including my father, have used these on his TR5. You then have two different pilot holes here. This is for the door release. So it's the handle inside that you uh, pivot around and it opens the door up. The small hole is for the TR4 and TR4A. The larger hole is for the TR5 and TR250. Same principle again down here. This is for the window winder. Again, the small hole is for the TR4 and TR4A. The larger hole is for the TR5 and TR250 models. You also get this small pilot hole here, which is for the screw that uh, goes through the pockets on the other side. As you can see, speaking of the pocket, this is the pocket coming through the slit here. And you can see the elastic on the side there. So looking at the actual panel, they're all high frequency welded as per original specification. So you have the four line pattern here. It literally embosses the material all the way through and actually sticks it to the board, it goes around here and down to the pocket. Same again on the actual pocket itself, it's embossed. A lot of people confuse this bit here for piping, it's not. It's the bulk of the material when it gets welded creates that effect there. And you can see underneath there's an elasticated pocket, uh, mainly used for maps and things back in the day. Obviously these days you could fit a smartphone or an iPad in there. Uh, we then piped them as per original spec. The majority of TRs left with white piping. Originally it was plastic piping, which we can offer. Uh, this customer has gone for leather cloth piping, which is our general preference. It looks a lot nicer. It also matches the seats, helps them hold the shape a little bit better on the seat. So we try and tie everything together and they're all stapled all the way around, very neatly done. You'll struggle to find anyone else in the world that will make panels as neatly as we do here. See our website for more details.